Their clan is the Az 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 Azuma Bito. Azumabito, yeah. Azuma Bito. Yeah. But, I um, think the only thing that would have made that moment better if she was like, okay, I'll come back to you, I promise. And then like hugs her. And you just see one of the blades come out of her sleeve. <laughs> gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Azuma beat that. And then just walks away. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. What's up, everyone? Welcome to Sasagio Sundays. On this show, we'll be discussing the final season of Attack on Titan. I'm your host, David, and joining me today, we have Taylor. Hello. Next, we have Justin. Hey, everybody. Next, we have Ku. Yo, yo. Next, we have Sasha. Shinzo Wo. And finally, we have Brian. Sasagio! <laughs> Get your pitchforks, everybody! <laughs> yeah! And guest, guest appearances by friend. Uh, thanks, man. So before we'll we start, too, I want to give a shout out to to Sasha, you and your Sasagios, man. We got this episode. We got the Sasagios this episode. Hell yeah! Oh, oh yeah! And- Shout out to you, well. dude. Oh, yeah, Classy Ulysses is doing it all, man. He's active on the YouTube videos. He's active in the Discord. Discord. You know, follow us on Twitter yeah. too. Shout so out, man. Shout out. Yep. Yeah, he gave me a lot of insight this week it? in the Discord for AOT. So, but I'm awkwardly bending my wrist at like a 38 degree angle and holding it up to my left pectoral <laughs> in honor mm-hmm. of you. So Sasageo, bro. <laughs> Sasageo. <laughs> Sasha, yeah, is, Sasha, you're definitely the guy protesting outside the citizen head queue, shouting that. <laughs> 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 I and mean then, that guy with the newspaper with a pitchfork. And then, ah, and then once, so yeah. people passing by would be like, "What are you guys like fight riding for?" And you'd be like, "I don't even know. I just want to say, yeah, just let's go." <laughs> you just chance to sagi out the guy. Definitely yeah, a yeah, yeah. mentality <laughs> moment. Sasha's Sasha, Sasha guy shouting Sagi and Brian's guy shouting Tatakai. Yeah, <laughs> dude, that's that's the ultimate. I just want to wear my fedora in public, so now I have a reason. <laughs> Protests. What? <laughs> but you know that was brian and mine's episode so we're very happy about that yep Damn. so similar to this episode we had um so we had a lot of, like a lot of, uh, i guess four struggling events and things being set up the first half and then last half was that crazy so i don't know um yeah I mean, for me, I enjoyed seeing uh, Hitch's glow up. I remember in one of the past episodes, we were talking about like mm-hmm. who we thought were like the good female characters yeah. from the show, and Hitch got brought up. And I was surprised. I totally forgot that Hitch was the one that was basically tasked with watching Annie. I totally forgot who Crystal she was. Form. So, like, I, don't know. I well, didn't either. I was way like... different in the past. Yeah, she looks she way different. Happened. You would not. There's no way, unless you knew, remembered her name, you wouldn't is even she, recognize her. Is she the one where she watched like her boyfriend die like way yes. back in the day? Well, yeah. no, that's her. Oh, uh, no, uh, no. She's no. She's the one. Her boy. Well, they weren't like I don't think officially it dating. But he's the one that died um, fighting the beast. When Erwin, yeah, made them all charge. Yeah, and she ran. Who did they run into oh. in the woods? Like, how did we first get introduced to them? Uh. <laughs> Who was that? Was it? I don't remember. Was it John in them? Or <sighs> that's a good. It could have been, but yeah, we 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 met. Ago, she had curly hair. She's in the military police with yeah. Annie. Hmm. But anyways, uh, yeah, she she so she was watching Annie. Um, and then we kind of cut to like everything that's going on with Aaron and figuring whoa, out what whoa, they're whoa. gonna do with him. We can't gloss over Armin over there trying to cop a feel when he's just staring at that like crystallized Annie. Like, what was that? I can see that in in the manga, it is more apparent that he is reaching for her face. But yes, in the anime, they did he's, make it seem like he was reaching for copping a feel. feel yeah. <laughs> but, like, wow. I, but I almost so, I almost like it that he's reaching for her press in this instance because it makes Hitch's comments so much more fitting. Of like, hey. No touching the merchandise, boy. Like I know you like her, but get out of here. <laughs> here man, has got the moves. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, man, the moves. If you mean by a girl that can't do anything to resist. Hey, man, he's a growing boy. You know. I thought other girls like Armin though. Uh, <laughs> in the it's show, no. In real girl. life, yeah. Real life, in real life. Oh, my bad. My bad. Okay. Yo. I-, I think that's yeah. Real quick, before we get into the details about the episode, I, I just got to get this out of the way, guys. I think this episode solidified 
wit so much better than Mappa just because they did my boy Pixies so wrong. I knew you were going to they... talk about that this this episode. I knew this, it. <laughs> th- this man looked legendary. He had the shine. He had the perfect eyes. He had that look. And he was drinking his you-know-what off in the original uh, wit-produced series in this episode he looked like a different character every single time like the first time you see him you're like all right his head looks kind of round looks like he's coming shaving too much in the next scene he looks like a withered old man who just survived chemotherapy (laughs) and you're like wait where'd this guy come from what's he doing over here and then in the next scene he has this big nose like he's that uh the evil guy from the smurfs you know the one that everyone's like yeah yeah so that's it just stuck out like a sore thumb this episode. I'm I'm sorry, Mappa. I'm sorry. You R.I.P. All right, anyways. <laughs> oh, <laughs> wow. For people who are not in the Discord, it's kind of funny. Justin just shared a picture. Apparently, there's probably something circulating around Reddit that's literally a Pixis comparison. <laughs> so this I is the first thing that I saw when I looked on Google. <laughs> yeah. Look at that. So, oh. you're not alone. Thank you. Thank you. That's my one nitpick. Uh, everything else, you guys, go ahead, take it away. But I had to get that out of the way. I'm like, they ruined one of my favorite characters. Like, just on looks alone, I, I was ready to throw up a little bit. In my mouth. <laughs> I feel you, man. I feel you. Yeah. So, yo, Brian, yeah, you got to find the one where he looks like he's like literally, like, I'll find it. I'll find it. But good Lord, it's bad. Anyways, go ahead, David. I apologize. No, no, it's all good. I mean, I'm still getting carried by Taylor and Justin. This, this, this. <laughs> in like the series so um did nothing happen david no no a lot of things happened so. <laughs> the first half was uh more i don't because i'm trying to go over in events i only remember the big parts at the end so i'm trying to remember the first half because yeah i mean so so, it started so, out with yeah, uh, ahead, yeah. Han- feel free to jump in as you'd like justin but yeah, yeah. Uh, you got it i believe it started out with hanji going around with own young Kompon. Onion, onion coupon, coupon please. <laughs> Are we still calling him onion coupon? No, I say that just because Sasha says man some respect. <laughs> Dude, that is some respect. <laughs> Who doesn't want to have a name like onion coupon? Oh lord, that's 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 <laughs> why his name is next child, basically. I yeah. better see onion coupon so, on that to forget, bro. <laughs> Uh, so I'm trying I, to think about the order yeah. of events. Why was so she going around? I, but because Aaron had already escaped, or did that happen after? Aaron, no, that, that was, that was after. <laughs> but but I think the reason uh, of the... Oh, go ahead, David. I was going to say that because the first part was um, basically we left off last episode how everyone suspected Yelena, Yelena how, and then mm-hmm. she had the... And then there's the, yes, the Pixies <laughs> scene. But basically how he was interrogating her, and then Hanji, I guess, suspected too how it was just mainly Yelena, so then they wanted more dirt on her from the other volunteers. So, and then, so that was why she was with, like, with um, all the other volunteers, and then it transitioned to um, Mikasa and Armin basically setting up, like, to the, the premiere in his office, how he denied them, but I was in the chair too, and I thought the chair was gonna be suspicious later, and then you just find out, oh, it's been blown up. It's it's already blown up this episode, so so I guess we could mention. We already mentioned it, yeah. And, and and they showed okay, they showed the three recruits too that out the window. Did, did we ever see them before, or are they all brand new? The, they're new. They're new. They're new. Oh, okay. And I can't but, remember if our because Armin makes note of seeing them in the courtyard earlier, and he's wondering like why are there recruits. Here, because it seems like in that courtyard area, like it's mostly supposed to be like the military police. I think yeah, this is like headquarters for the military crew. Yeah, I think it's for like the for the paradise, like police, not like scout. Mm -mm. So, So, yeah, so it's not normal that the the scout regiment is there. So he did make note of of that specific of like, yeah, I saw like three people Mm -hmm. that are already here. Um, But yeah, to your point, David. Mikasa Armin go to meet with the premier Zachley, beg, well, not beg, but basically want to tell him that they know that, you know, things are still kind of suspicious in terms of Aaron and his actions, and they feel like they should have the opportunity to speak to Aaron as, you know, his childhood friends to see if they can get any information out of him. And then Zachley obviously says, like, yeah, that that's not happening. Like, at this time, like, we don't know who we can really trust within even our own walls now. And so that gets shut down, and then as that gets shut down, Mikasa and Armin are leaving. They see the three individuals from the military police walking in to give, you know, some form of update to Zachary. And Mikasa mentions Armin of like, hey, let me go, like, 
you know, eavesdrop and see what we can learn. And then, like, as they're talking about that, the explosion happens. That was a huge explosion, too, by the way. That was, that was a huge Oh, yeah, huge exactly bomb. got fucked up. <laughs> he got, that was a huge explosion, and he somehow only lost, like, half his, like, his, his, he lost half his body, but his front top half was intact somehow, but. Yeah. Still. Very it's convenient. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> to land in front of the protesters and stuff. And then we get the Sasagio, <laughs> the Shin Solo Sasagio chant from the crowd. So. Which was obviously best, Sasha's best favorite, favorite moment. moment of the whole series. <laughs> but honestly, though, it was I, used so well. But no, honestly, I I, I felt it <clears throat> from the protest hall because you see, it's been building up how everyone's like they're they they're feeling like tense with all the situations, and there's such a huge faction of people who want to support Aaron. So I definitely, I definitely see the effects of the protest. Yeah. yeah. I mean, they're being kept in the dark on so many things, and particularly Aaron, who, as you said, David, like, that is their driving force of, like, the new Eldian Empire. So it's reaching, and, and it's reached that we, bubbling point. We see point. that, too, later on with uh, when the military and the scouts are, like, bickering at each other in front in, in front of um, Kiyomi, too, which is so weird for her to be caught up in all that. Yeah, it's like, so awkward for them. It's like, like oh, hey. <laughs> So, um, but at least Pixies was very accommodating of like, oh, Miss Kiyomi, I'm sorry you had to see that, but you know, it, <laughs> shit's going down here. I just think it's just so weird how like, how, like they just, yeah, it was like the they're t- in the room while that was happening. Like, I don't, I don't understand why like they did that in front of them, but I, I like how she responded though, where she was like, "Don't worry, everybody does this. Every country does this, not just yeah. you." <laughs> I did. I, I more so liked the involvement with Kiyomi and Mikasa, where Kiyomi's like, "Oh, Mikasa, like you know, we're gonna save you. You're our princess." And Mikasa's just like, "Yeah, that's great and all, but it's like I know you just care about our resources. Like you don't really care about you know this or that." And just like puts Kiyomi in her place. She's, like, she's just like doesn't say anything. She's like, "Damn, well, I got she's, owned." No, she's basically like, "No, no, like I, no." Everyone does think we are just money grubbing like Dixons or whatever, but we do what we can to survive. It's like, okay, well, at least you're honest now, but. Uh, yeah, I guess, yeah, because they did touch about, like, if they came back to the Mizuru or whatever, that they cause, would, like, like disown what, like, their clan. Like, their clan is the Az- Az- Azumabito. Azumabito, yeah. Mm-hmm. Azumabito. Yeah. But, I um, think the only thing that would have made that moment better, if she was like, okay, I'll come back to you, I promise. And then, like, hugs her, and you just see one of the blades come out of her sleeve. <laughs> gotcha! Azuma beat that! And then just walks away. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, uh, I know. Man. But I thought, I don't know. I thought it was pretty interesting how, like, back to the bakery, like, how everyone's, like, the, the military, all, like, the military police are so pissed that they have to go with, like, they felt they were forced to go with, like, Aaron's plan, the the, the, the Jaegerist, whatever, but, like, Pixie just comes in and, like, oh. says, like, we have no choice, we have to, like, we can't, like, um, like, risk, like, a collapse, an internal collapse, we basically have to, we, we don't Play like this, but we have to wants, do it, yeah. 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 I love how uh, that's like classic 101 labeling and then divide and conquer. Hey guys, these guys have, you know, they're the same people, but they have different beliefs. So we're going to call them Jaegerists. Yes, yeah. Jaegerists. Get which, them. Which, by the way, like, down. which, by the way, it's definitely a backfire. When you sit, when you label like that, then you, you like, you're going to get support of the people who, who that, that appeals to. So, like, like if they think that's, uh, if they're trying to, like, to, like, label them as, like, as, like, an outcast or as, like, as, like, insurgents, like, no, that's clearly the opposite. They just gotta like rile people up to be more revolutionary. So, I just find it funny how like the right hand man of the Jaegerists, besides like um, I think it was his flock. It's like yep. I was Aaron, and then I'm rolling up, and Flock's my number one guy. I know, like Aaron probably doesn't know too much about. It. I'd be like, oh my god, like <laughs> of course, like I get this guy, like <laughs> leading my <laughs> revolution. <laughs> this reminds hey, me of Flock. Wormtail going back to Voldemort. Like I was the one weakling who was too scared to move away from yeah. you. <laughs> he is. He has definitely changed my perception of him, and I, I really appreciate Flock now. You know, looking back at it, I just God, think I, I misunderstood you, his values. <laughs> so, do you really? Do you really know? Flock, Flock, I just bandwagons because he's a Jaegerist boy. He's a Welcome to now. the Jaegerist Club. Jaegers! Jaeger Bob! Wee wee! And then we, we yeah. finally got the much anticipated moment of Aaron getting to throw his jacket on in slow motion with his, oh, you know, yeah. well, his oh, yeah. Give all the fan now, service for the guys don't, and the girls. Don't honestly i i couldn't help but think it'd be really funny if aaron just like fucked up putting the jacket on like either it's like hit him in the face with like the flock throwing it to him or like he completely misses the armhole it's just like ah shit it's like pick it up off the ground (laughs) 
he's been through too much to, for that to happen. Like he's just so cool now. Man bun achieved. Yeah, Aaron is such yep. a chad. <laughs> he he's can the do best. no wrong. You know, it'd be even better if he's like, "Hey, flock." I didn't even use my Titan powers that time. I just put on eye makeup to make it look like I did. I'm Aaron. Yes. <laughs> Aaron Zoolander. <laughs> I would love it. That would be the best. Or and not. all the fans just left the show. Yeah, they're out. And, and class <laughs> Ulysses, you with me, bro? You with me? Get in here. <laughs> I don't know. Even Ulysses would join you on that. Uh, uh, yeah. I don't know. But, uh, so we have that over epic moment of the jacket finally happening that we originally saw in the, the trailer for this season. Um, so worth and, it. And then we had everybody's fan favorite at the very end of the episode. Good girl Cart Titan has now arrived. Oh, in yeah. Paris. Oh, I forgot about that. <laughs> Let's be honest. She's How there just to see the doctor. There? We don't know. I, I kind of wonder, like, <laughs> the border patrols of, like, all these countries must just suck ass. They're just like, all right, I'm going to go infiltrate this country. I'm going to go infiltrate that. And they're just all chilling in, like, the main hub. Well, let's it's be like, honest. With Paradis, the Border Patrol are the Titans just rolling around ready to eat. Well, Actually, not at night. But well, no, they're not even there anymore. Didn't they say gone. they wiped them but, out? Yeah. yeah. I, I, so I'll Border s- Patrol's non-existent. I'll just say, like, it just felt more like, maybe I'll give it to Vernon Fidel, because, like, they kind of infiltrated once, and maybe Reiner helped, too, so maybe he knows more secret, a, more of a secret way to get in. So I'll I'll, I, I'll Good point. take it at that point, yeah. yeah. Then again, the history of Border Patrol guards there have been terrible. Like, look at Hannes. Hannes just drank, 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 and then he got Aaron's <laughs> yeah, mom. Yeah, oh, there. Yeah. Yes. That too. So. They're not the heaviest on uh, security and precautions <laughs> and things of those nature. Yeah. I was going to mention before that, I was going to mention too how um, they did mention how uh, the Jaegerists, like, they think there's like, uh, what, a hundred of them that infiltrate, like, the military mm-hmm. or the scouts. So, I, I, well, I mean, this might not be enough, but I figured maybe, like, last episode, we were wondering how, like, how Gabby and Falco escaped. Maybe it's because, like, people who are guarding them didn't really care if they escaped. They're too busy, like, doing their own thing or, like, trying to set up for mm, Aaron's escape. So, yeah. That's, yeah. But it, that's crazy. Like, there's, like, like about 100 people who, this other faction that, like, that just, like, it's yeah. like a huge prison break. And then also, yeah, you mentioned, and then, yeah. Oh, yeah, go ahead. You mentioned how, like, like Peak showed up the last part, too. But so I wonder, like, because cause the also ended with uh, the restaurant that Niccolo worked yep. at. So then it makes yep. me wonder, too, like, very important. Is like, so, are, so, like, so far, we, we know, so we know that we have, like, different factions, but is Niccolo, is his, him in the restaurant, are they gonna be, are they working for the Jaegerists, or are they helping out, like, Peak and whoever, like, to just, like, infiltrate there as well? Like, that's the only thing I, I'm not sure about. Yeah. We so. don't know. And it's even furthermore, it's like, dude, does Aaron's, you know, Jaeger's faction equally align with Zeke? Like, we still don't really know what Zeke's thinking yeah. out in the forest. So there's a lot of factions in play so right that's now. Like, that's like my one main question is like, is like are, yeah, who's, are you with, the, yeah, whose faction are you with? Like, are you with the Jaegerus? Or are you, did you, did you, or, or did Niccolo and the other Marlins, did they help like Peek and like Reiner like sneak in again? Yeah. Yeah. Good questions. Good can nobody help peak? Let's be honest. <laughs> yeah, my one friend when, when he D. saw peak, he was just <laughs> like, "I I hate peak. Like he's everywhere. He's such a huge like plot armor moment for Marlins. I'm just like, eh. <laughs> you know. Yeah, I'm not a big fan. I, of her. I, I, I thought it. her and, and Gabby and Pidgeot, they all need to just go to the wayside. <laughs> Forget all of them. <laughs> Glad that at least he didn't put Falco on that list. I'll take it. <laughs> no, no, Falco's my boy. I'm, I'm chill with him because he's go. understanding. You know, he's he's empathetic. Oh, oh, yeah. He's everything that's just nice about a person. I see. Was this was this before or after he became a Jaegerus? Uh, well, you know, uh, that's still to be determined, <laughs> sir. <laughs> His files under review. <laughs> <laughs> But, yeah, I'm just glad this episode was not another Gabby fest. It felt so good not to see her even once. I was like, yes, yes. Oh, the end, yeah. Bro, yeah, you know, that's yeah. Yeah. I just closed my eyes at that moment. <laughs> uh, but <laughs> but it, 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 it was so good. Uh, great episode. The, the Shinzo <laughs> Sagio won the top 10 moments. Is that the only thing you remember from this episode? <laughs> That's really it. Like everything else is just a blur. I'm like, okay, some guy's body came out that window, <laughs> and then these guys were screaming, Shinzo. They weren't even scared. They were just like, yeah, Shinzo. 
<laughs> These are the guys. Of, like how few people were out there. I thought there was gonna be like a shit ton of people like out in front of the military, and then they like zoom out, and it's maybe like twenty people. Yeah. Mm. yeah. And I'm like, oh, okay, cool. <laughs> uh... I, I think you know they're, they're very uh, they're worn thin after all the Titan attacks and the talks of war, but. Man, I, I'm just, I'm really fascinated. I think this season has just been a whirlwind in terms of what's going on. It feels like it's been all over the place, honestly, in a good way, in a good way. Um, so now I'm, I'm happy to see it starting to come together where oftentimes I feel like I'm lagging behind in who's with who, what's going on. Like halfway through the episode, I was like, wait, who is even yelling again? How, how did she set all this up? So I'm glad things are starting to, you know, clarifying crystallize in the show so i can't wait to see the next episode and uh i'm just sad yeah. only four left we're getting only close left. Oh, but man. uh as ulysses was saying he's pretty confident in terms of because he reads the manga or, as well where he was or she was saying um that most likely we'll get a part two hopefully because it fits really well with like a 12 episode 12 13 episode second part season so mm. fingers crossed but if it goes right. movie Ooh. It is not Thoughts? gonna. Ooh. I'm about to lose my shit if I see Final <laughs> Season Part Two. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you right now, there's gonna be a Part Two. There's no way. I, like, I don't know. After they're on right now, okay, all right, all right. I, I will be so triggered if <laughs> if there's an announcement. Attack on Titans Final Season Part Two announced. It's like, oh god, Ma- yeah, marketing one hundred and one, baby. Yeah, they, they come oh, back or they or they just are they basically just baited everybody into you know into it. Like there better Probably be a little a, bit of both. Uh, an explanation or a press conference yeah. saying, "Yeah, I'm sorry, there was a uh, translation error in the naming of the final season. Uh, we actually meant season five, but they <laughs> meant it for, for final. I mean, or some all, shit. Like, they could always say like, oh, hey, like the first half of the final season airing. Now, yeah, I mean, half. to be fair, they just say Attack on Titan final season. They don't say like the this is these episodes are the final season. It could be any amount of episodes whoa, is whoa, the final whoa. season." No, that's, look, that, look at this you know hardcore like? defense right here. It sounds like a cop because I know what they have to do. Like they no. fucked up. It sounds like a cop out to me, sir. How dare it? You? It definitely no. is. <laughs> I, I don't know. Listen, oh. yeah. we went from Reiner putting a shotgun in his mouth to Sasha getting a bullet shot through her chest to Aaron shaving and revealing his salami leg was all a lie. Man, it's it's been a wild <laughs> season. So. I'm very curious to see. We got some restaurants, guys named Onion Coupons, and really bad pixies. <laughs> like, oh uh, I, I, that's my one big flaw. This this whole season has just been like the distracting, jarring sometimes look of their faces and man casa, of course. But I got to show you more pictures of pixies in the previous ones I because, good, like I said, <laughs> I mean, <laughs> dude, I'm gonna print out his pictures and hang them on your wall. <laughs> I have an open spot right there for him. All right. I was, I was gonna say at yeah. your wedding, I'm gonna cut out his face and wear it over my face. <laughs> oh god. So I was gonna say the last couple episodes, yeah, like um I don't know, like I mean I was still enjoying them, but felt very like I felt like I couldn't like like think about anything because like because it didn't feel like I could like piece together much, but now it feels like it's starting to come together this episode. But, and then I guess one thing I'm wondering too is like if if uh, Peak, if she infiltrated, and if other of the Mayan military infiltrated, like, is Aaron, is he gonna be able to leave the island at all? Or is he gonna have to stick around and, like, fight them with Zeke? Or is it gonna be some sort of betrayal with Zeke? Like, that's what I'm wondering. Mm. I, I guess I'm wondering, if, is Aaron gonna be able to leave Paradis to actually fight Marley? Or are they gonna have to fight, to do, like, the, to fight the surprise attack right now? That's, I guess what I'm wondering after this last mm. episode. Yeah. Yeah, but as a person who does not watch the show, you have four episodes left. I don't think so. Okay. Yeah, I, I'll take your word for it, Trent. <laughs> nice, 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 nice like analysis a, there. Hey, I'm a, I'm an AOT aficionado. Yes. I got this. Yeah, I mean, AOT, <laughs> AOT of alpaca. I, I yes. vouch for this man yes. as his duologist and AOT aficionado. <laughs> yeah, as a man who knows that they're alpacas and sheep. I know exactly what I'm yes. talking about. Yes, people who so, don't uh, know don't know inside will choke and be so confused, but. So how yeah, do we got a troll comment on anyway. I'll talk about oh mess. Go. <laughs> how do you think it's gonna end though with four more episodes left? I don't know. I feel like if there is a if there's a surprise attack, they probably maybe deal with it here 
and then they'll save the rest to attack Marley. That's the only way I can think of. Like, I feel like the last part has to be attacking Marley. I think there might be actually like a final match between Reiner and Aaron. I feel like that's that's got to be how they end the season, mm. right? Since since Peck, Pecky or whatever is back, I would imagine that the uh, like the other Titans are here as well, and then they're definitely going to transform and have a giant Titan battle again. Yeah, I can see that. I keep thinking I'm I'm still like, I don't know. I keep thinking that Falco is gonna inherit um Reiner's like armor titan, but I don't know like if he inherits it. I don't know if he's gonna like continue with Marley, if he's gotta join Aaron's side. That's the only other thing too. But I just have this, this feeling that Falco is supposed to be the one that inherits like the 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 armor titan. Yeah. Well actually yeah, well actually well 'cause I think well because I think him and Gabby are supposed to like be the next inherit of the was it the, the jaw titan from his brother mm -hmm. yeah but i just have this mm -hmm. feeling that like based on what, what's going on i feel like it just seems, seems like seems like they're trying to set up to have valco inherit the armor titan i don't know or maybe it's the jaw titan i don't know i, I just i just feel like falco's they're saying that falco inherits a titan so we'll see yeah could be <laughs> but i don't know I think that's all I had. To, I had for this episode. I don't. It's like anyone had anything else. Uh, fuck Gabby. Um, <laughs> and that's about she it. She wasn't even in this episode, man. It doesn't matter, bro. <laughs> you got to keep it relevant. You got to keep it top of mind so people know. <laughs> gotta keep it. Gotta, keep, gotta keep the hashtag alive. I, yeah. I forgot. Just, what the, I forgot what the hashtag was. Hashtag. Sasha said. Justice yeah. for Potato Girl, girl. Uh, dude. <laughs> I lost it. I'm sorry. The girl, girl. <laughs> Justice for Potato Girl, right? That should be a hashtag, right? Mm. Fuck yeah, Abby. I'm just saying. Yeah, indeed. <laughs> All right. And that's it. We're just going to end it here. So thanks, guys. For, again, thank, thank chat for hanging with us. Thanks. Uh, thanks, guys. Thanks, Joker. Thanks, uh, yeah, thank you, thanks everyone, Aaron, as always. well. I always want to thank the panel for joining me this week. Thanks. It was always fun. No problem. Also, yeah. thank thank you again, Ulysses, as well, for commenting on our videos and also uh, talking in Discord as well. Yeah. Yes, so. Ulysses, if you're there, Shinzo Wo! Sasage! Yes. He lags timing. out of existence. So, we'll that'd be it for this week, guys. We'll see you next time. Bye. 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 Sasage, yo. Bye. Bye.